Hey everybody, welcome back for another exciting episode of Let's Replay Tiny Toons Adventure Buster Buzz Loose. In the last episode we beat off the first stage and now we're going to go into the second stage. Getting used to the controls in this stage we'll need to use the dash feature. When the dash gauge is full you can press the top R or L buttons to get an extra boost of speed. Very useful to beat this game too. Wait, there's more! When you use dash in certain places, you can climb up walls. You may be able to find some useful items this way. Ironically, we used this earlier, and they didn't have an explanation for it. Otherwise, we wouldn't have been able to pass the first stage without using the RNL. Anyways, Pluggies, what's the next stage? Yuck! The Western movie stage, of course. I am the main character. I am the main actor. I am the lead. I am the star. And like I said before, he is self absorbed and a narcissist. Buster, Montana seems to be up to something, same as usual. I wouldn't expect anything else from Montana Max. See, if you... See, I believe in you... There we go. Do that, you dash right into it. Like that. Oddly enough, you can do that, and... Where's my rewind? There we go. Thank you. I know, don't rewind, but my controls got stuck. Basically, my controller got... kind of froze for a second. No, I'm not kidding. See, look at that, my buttons aren't working for some reason. You motherfucking wily coyote, I swear to god. See here, the rope looks faster than before. Maybe it's because it's challenge mode. I guess some elements of the game changes in challenge mode. Anyways, who would leave so many dogs inside a freaking place like this is beyond me. And barrels. I blame Wily Cody for this. It's too late. Hi, Montana Max have gotten all the valuables. Ha ha ha. Bye, Buster Bunny. Hey, give me back my swag. The only one who can have swag in this LP is me! Anyways, welcome to the train section of the game. Even for the second stage, it actually can be rather difficult, in my opinion. Because there's so much stuff that you have to avoid, like Wily e. Coyote and these stupid little nets. If you get caught in them, dash. Because if they drag you to the end of the screen, you will lose a life. And sometimes, Wily Coyote will try to throw tomatoes at you. Just a pretty dick move. Like that. Oh, You know what I mean, it's kind of a dick move how the game will do that if you're not dashing at the right specific spot. Hmm, kinda glitched through that last one. Not complaining. There we go. Wow, no, no fair. I actually freaking, you know, legitly did that. My controller froze for some reason. I must be low on battery again. I have to replace the batteries after this episode. You know, actually, let me go do that right now. I'll be right back. 
All right, I'm back with a fresh pair of batteries. I was actually on the red for my Xbox wireless controller, which kind of sucks. Of course, when I charged it, well, it's been a while since I came back from my home, so I must have left it uncharged. Oh, wait, my phone's ringing. I'll be right back. Don't you just hate getting interrupted all the time? Some random notification on my phone. Whatever. There's no way in hell the freaking segments of this train would be able to move like this and descend so slowly. Well, it is a video game. That and this is also a video game cartoon. I call shenanigans right there. There you go. I know I said I wouldn't be cheap, but seriously, that was kind of cheap as well. And faulty electrical wiring could probably get someone a seizure and some evil guy from Yale. I knew all those people from Yale were up to no good. All expensive school-like and stuff, making us normal people feel dumb. We're probably smarter than them. I think there's like supposed to be an extra. No. Maybe it was just an extra hit that was there. You know, extra energy, but I could have sworn that was a extra heart container there. And the annoying wizard guy, whose name always eludes me. Let him get closer. Just so I can get the extra stars. There you go. This, uh, back in the day, was my least favorite part of the game. Because you had to jump on the pieces of wood. That looks like, that look like chocolate bars. I mean, come on, they look like chocolate bars, don't you think so? I'm not crazy. What do you mean I'm crazy? The Schwarzenegger dog. Who does not fuck off, I swear. My god. And evil vultures, and... Unfair hitbox. Look at that. That is not cool. There's no way these things let me jump. I don't even like birds. My god. This has been the train ride of fail. Not very good either. As you can see, I am very rusty. Hate to start playing some more Mario hacks. And get the rust out of the hinges. Die, train! Alright, go, 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 slow scrolling world of doom. Which has no. incidentally, has no meaning or reference towards the Norns of Doom, of course. Hey, okay, game myself. Just because it has of doom doesn't mean it's patented by myself. Or could it be? One to one. Hurry up, slow ass train. Oh man, I remember I remember the times that I had to like haul ass and fast forward and etc. just to get through a level. Thank goodness for unlimited time. Oh my god, look at him. He's looking. He looks like he's gonna have a seizure or a heart attack or something. Calm down. Jeez. Take a placebo or something. Take some chill pills. Anyways, 
Somebody help me, the train is out of control! He's always like causing trouble and stuff, man, guys. Okay, let's jump on the rail cart and escape, etc. And I butchered that pretty badly. Come on! Faster! Back to the future! Ah, uh, good movie. Anyways, another round in the Wheel of Games. Let's see what mini game we get. Hopefully, we get a different one. And let's see what we get today. Oh, the Babs mini game. In my opinion, one of the more difficult mini games. This game is Babs. Find your friends. You have a chance to win extra lives. Basically, the idea of this game is find everyone and don't get touched. Open the door to find your friends. Don't let Elmira or Arnold the Swords of Dogger catch you, or you won't be able to find your friends and get extra lives. Watch out for Dizzy Devil, too, because he'll. Holy shit, balls! He'll mess your day up like that. That was pretty failed. Show off what happens when you actually win. This is just a mini game and not the actual game itself. Swords of Dog, stay away. There you go. Well, this game also has a very unforgiving timer. Just actually, what, like 10 seconds or something like that? Pretty unforgiving. Anyways, on the next episode of Tiny Toons Adventure, hopefully less fail, less rewinding, and less me dying to stupid stuff. Until then, I'll see you guys next time.